former president Uhuru sister Christina Pratt made her first public appearance on April 24th, months after losing the Jubilee nomination. Pratt, accompanied by other members of the Board of Trustees of the National Fund for the, Di for the Disabled of Kenya, met President William Ruto at the State House in Nairobi. During the meeting, Pratt briefed Ruto on her organization's role in advocating for the rights of physically challenged individuals in the country. The board also shared some of their achievements and long-term goals with the head of state in the first meeting since the transition of power. After the brief, Ruto vowed to support the board led by Pratt in line with the bottom-up economic model. Her contribution to the so sector is immense, spanning over four decades. Pratt's achievements include establishing the Kenya Institute of Special Education to train special needs tutors. In 1918, Pratt was recognized by former U.S. President Jimmy Carter following her contribution to empowering persons with disabilities. Her entry into politics was imminent after Jubilee Party nominated her for a Senate position in 2022. However, she failed to make the cut. Pratt's meeting with Ruto came days after Mamangina made a rare public appearance on April 20th, urging Kenyans to maintain peace for the country's development. What do you think about retired President Uhuru Kenyatta's sister, Christina Pat, meeting with President William Ruto? And do you think it was okay for them to have a sit-down talk for this meeting? Do you think there is something positive that is going to come out of it? Leave your comment down below.